It's great to have a positive attitude, isn't it? Everyone tells you have a positive attitude. No matter what life throws you, have a positive attitude. Some of these people want to say, be positive always. The people who are in power are there because they have a positive attitude, they say. They say if you have a negative attitude, you won't get anywhere. To me, this is hogwash. Of course, evil people rule and have lots of money, success, power, and terrible people, and nice people, great people, fail. But I'm a fool. A positive attitude is always a good thing. The more, the merrier. And who is one of the most positive people on this planet? Fred Phelps in Westboro Baptist Church. When other people are sad, they rejoice. Other people say, it's so terrible we have soldiers dying. It's so terrible to see a soldier die. It's terrible to see these natural disasters. It's terrible to have car crashes, plane crashes, whatever. But Westboro Baptist Church doesn't get down on their dumps or things like that. They have a positive attitude. They hold up signs that say, thank God for dead soldiers. One of their most famous signs. They've also hold up, held up signs that say, thank God for dead miners. They hold up a sign which says, thank God for the space shuttle exploding. A positive attitude is always positive. A positive attitude could never be sadistic, could it? If it could, then those people who are into positive attitude, positive attitude, every single thing, every single situation, need to relook. In social work class, the professor t told us to think of every terrible event that could happen and think positive. So if somebody just lost half their family, say, don't be sad. Look on the bright side. At least you have half of your family left. And that's what Westboro Baptist Church is doing. They are the epitome of positive thinking. A positive attitude is the reason Fred Phelps is 79, soon to be 80 years old on November 13th of this year, 2009, and very healthy. A positive attitude is everything.